Okay, we're back, or well, we've been live on the five minute intermission. People just hanging in the back. But, um, Matt, are we good? All right. Come yes, on. good. That is the yeah, clear we'll voice of Nick David. Oh, wait, do I get headphones? No. Fully closed Nick David. I just David. trust you can hear me. You can, I mean, these don't reach very no, long. That's fine, that's fine. I'll, I'll we'll go just tell you, like that. Just tell you if you're not on the mic. Yeah, yeah. So, Matt Miller just performed, just did, yep. the, just did the thing. Performed in the show. No, you can show. You've done a bunch of these. You're, I would say, you're becoming a regular. It's pretty regular. Yeah, I've been doing it for like a year and a half. Mm -hmm. yeah. Not every month, but most. Yeah, every other. Yeah. There's a little bit of a stretch where I was doing it every month. That's a stretch. Yeah. Then there's, but there, there comes, there, there, there can be droughts. I was saying, I was starting to get to this earlier, but sometimes, uh, like tonight. There's 11 comics, so I'm guessing did about five minutes, six minutes. Yeah, so. five. Yeah, so but one time five. I went and there was actually like five colossally outstanding five. But Probably the, the best. There, there was um, there was a. Should we be naked for the podcast? Not, well, you know, you can take your top off if you want, but nah, no. Nah, my best white tee. <laughs> V-neck. Nice. Yeah, Just I one visible stain. I like it. A um, few invisible stains. <laughs> you know, a black light, and then you can see a couple more. So we. Okay. Be careful with that. Oh, I make my bed. Yeah. I'll take it off. Podcast rules banging and swinging. So um, the show at one point was. There were like four cancellations. So before I went on stage, Andy said, oh, we'll just take it till take it till 11. And you don't realize what the time is until you're on stage. And it was 10:40, so I was just doing a 20-minute set. Oh, nice! Because people canceled. Which Wait, is, the it's, first time you did it? Is that what you're no, no, oh. not the very first time I did it, but in an early enough time where it was just too much. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, damn, dude. I have a suspicion, and I wanted to ask Andy, and I'll ask you about it because because you've done this a number of times. I, I suspect that there's a lot of cancellations. You know, there aren't that, there aren't as many. Huh. I feel like, and sometimes it's not that people are like backing out, it's that sometimes they're coming from far away and they couldn't make it on, at least on time before the show ends, or there's been times where if you're at another show around town and it's running late, yeah. I feel like if you I, also I get, maybe like get some I, bullshit excuses too. I feel like if I, I, if I went to a show and at some point somebody might be able to convince me to do it, but then at the last minute, I'd be like, "Fuck that!" <laughs> like it's like there'd be some way where you know I'd yeah. be like, "Dude," and I'd be like, "Ah," and then the day would come, and I'd be like, "Nah." <laughs> I don't know, man. I think Nick, you you could. Do they do the audience segment yet? Yeah. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like you should go watch some of the you show. Audience member, you do it together. <laughs> well, fun, 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 I, I, I'll go watch some of the show. Yeah. So. I'll wait till there's only men left so I don't see like a, a creep that's just going out there to, to see the naked women. Well, all the no, women have performed. Things, there you go. That's what I'm saying. All, all right, good. Oh, yeah. Kind of just one One of them. Um, yeah. So. One of them is a gay man, so you will look like a creep still if you're getting out. No, you're not. Okay. Bye. Let's start again. Hi, Matt. Hey. A creep or a creep? What's the name? Is the naked? You'll be a creep. He's podcast. French. Oh, okay. He's French. French and gay. No. <laughs> I mean, you don't even need to say one of those. Yeah. It's an <laughs> one. <It's> synonymous. <laughs> Sacre bleu. All right, when you are French, I am gay in French. Hey, welcome to our one viewer. Matt Miller ostracizing an entire country. <laughs> it's okay. They can come at me if they want. Come at me. Come at me, bro. Come at me, French. Croissant. Yeah. French. French. Yeah. Come at me, the monsieur. French. Yeah. French I used to love someone who was French. And I don't love him. Oh, You're yeah, a French Canadian. That doesn't count. <laughs> so, so, all right. Tell me a little bit about how you heard about the show. When you heard about it, did you think you wanted to do it? Did you take any convincing, whether it be someone else or yourself? Uh, when did I hear about it? I think I just heard about it just on Facebook, people posting it. And then I wanted to do it, and I sought out Andy, 
or I may have asked you first actually, mm -hmm. and then you sent me to Andy, and then I got on. Like I really wanted to do it. It just seems that being naked is the way you should do comedy. <laughs> like I prefer yeah. to perform naked. You know? Some people have done comedy for the first time naked. Yeah, yeah, I've heard those stories. Yeah. You come into this world naked. You come into this comedy world naked. And yeah, I think you might as well be. You know, I wear my jokes on my sleeve. If I don't get sleeve, all jokes. <laughs> more, room, <laughs> more, more room for jokes. <laughs> Your sleeves are short. There we go. Will you make a t-shirt that says less sleeves, more jokes? <laughs> less sleeves, more jokes. I should. I will, oh, you uh, can buy my t-shirt? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Hashtag less sleeves, more jokes. Yeah, less yeah. Jokes. I mean, Rick, you can come and sit down again. We got one mic free if you want to hang out until the next person comes. If someone comes, you immediately have to go. Yeah. 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 Immediately to the back of the bus, sir. All right, my fault. Well, well. Yeah, back <laughs> your mom just hit it, so yeah. status quo as usual. Yeah, one time I did a show and a former boss of mine was in the audience. Really? And he <laughs> never hired you again. But <laughs> did you did you know that before? No, no, no. no. He, just, he just said, hey, you're great, Matt. And I was like, oh, thanks, Rob. The next day or at, <laughs> after the show? Oh, okay. Cool. Yeah. So was that yeah. was that essentially your performance review? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. I don't great. know how he, how he felt about it because I'm like, I'm usually real shy and stuff. So him seeing me like that. How many times have you done it? Ten times. Really? Yeah. Ten times. And since you're here almost every how long has the show been going? How long have you been? The show is actually over ten years old. Holy shit. Yeah, it's moved a lot, yeah. <laughs> it's, 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 a lot of tens you said. We got a couple of tens on the show tonight. I'll take it. So how, so give if you had a number, if you had a guess at a number of how many times you've done a show. Um well, I would say I began doing it uh, five years ago, and I there was a few years where I, I didn't do it every month. So I would say uh, forty nine. Okay. So tonight Almost is my fiftieth show. Oh, <laughs> Congratulations! Thank you, thank you. Uh, I can probably find out the number because I videotape my sets all the time. But that would be oh, do you, you have that back naked set? Yeah. <laughs> you have a backlog five years? Yeah. Yeah. It's, I have thousands of videos of <laughs> private YouTube links. Uh, private do you have any other naked shows in there? Fully naked shows? No, no, no. Just just me. Like private naked shows? Yeah, yeah. Private naked shows. But nobody knows. <laughs> I would never do that. Matt, what specific comics do you want to see naked? What specific comics? <laughs> no, you're wondering if I'd like to see yours. Every <laughs> comic naked. <Yeah. laughs> Because I feel like a lot of people are hiding stuff under there. <laughs> you know? What do you think they're hiding? Like? I don't know. Maybe they they got some sort of wire connected to the brain to bring jokes. <laughs> you think, <laughs> you think people are wearing wires? wires is there? Can are we you, buy those? Are you in the mafia, man? Like, I think everyone's wearing a, ma a, a, a wire. They should perform naked. My mom's main name is Capone. Really? No. Uh, <laughs> it's Wilson. It's Wilson. I don't even use it as a password, so you can't even get in there. Not even in your, um, if you forget your password, in. No, I do my dad's maiden name. Did <laughs> <laughs> dad have maiden name? No. Why not? And of course he is. <laughs> your maiden name. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, 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 what the? Hey, what the? This is locker room talk. <laughs> oh, yeah. Grab, Grab him by the maiden name. name. <laughs> Grab him by the name. Uh, so the first time you did it, you heard about it. Did you, so you, you'd not come to watch a show prior? I had never seen it before, mm -hmm. yeah. Because sometimes there's shows going on in the adjacent studio room, and comics will come on and be like, oh, what are you doing? Like, you're doing the naked show, and then they'll try to peek in. Free loaders. I had two rooms. rooms. Yeah. Yeah, there's a big theater, and then there's a small room in the back, which used to be our green room. I'm motioning to it. It's not <laughs> geographically. Um, we are in a different part of the building, so that's not correct. Yes, don't mind me. Yeah. As I have half of my face. Yeah, you're partially obscured. You know, those seats are adjustable. But, um, <laughs> they don't want you to I'll move over. Yeah, I, I want to be close to you. Oh, okay, I'll stay here. I want to be close. So, were your first yeah. experience, is it, is it, was it just the same? I mean, I know, uh, did you try? I, I've seen you be more physical on stage here at the Naked Show than I have at other shows. Yeah, well, I do an act out at this one. Uh, that would not work with clothes on. 
Give well, people a little bit of a background. You don't have to do the whole well, bit. How dirty can I be? I guess this is a naked podcast. You say whatever you want. Yeah. Okay. I said the I F think word all earlier, blank so. are. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I think all people deserve happiness. Okay. What I was gonna say, but um. All right, cut his mic. <laughs> <laughs> I do a joke about coming on my own face, and uh, I sort of show the audience by propping myself up on the wall, so my dick dangles <laughs> over me. <my mouth. laughs> yes. So did you do that tonight? Yeah. You do that. Have you, have you do that every time? I've done is that, that, that since the start, actually. Start? Yeah. yeah. It's called dedication, people. But the start of you doing the naked show. No, my life. No, <laughs> no but you, you don't do that. You don't do that. Like Most job are. interviews. <laughs> As a young five-year-old. Uh, yeah, I mean, I've done the bit before, but I've only done the act of the naked show because I feel like it makes the most sense. Because mm. if I did it with clothes on, it would just be like. It'd be like, yeah. It doesn't really a, make the most sense though, because if you're coming on your face, your dick isn't flaccid, right? Well, can you do that? Uh, I guess that's a good point. Value. You know what? I got my production value. <laughs> Talk to Jack Burke. He's got a line on some Viagra that doesn't kick in in time. Oh. Um, <laughs> that like there's a callback from a previous story from the segment you guys weren't here for, so that's why it seemed like it bombed, internet audience. I was here for it, so I, like I appreciate it. I like there we go. Yeah. Hey, a silent nod. <laughs> um, yeah, dude, that. But that's the only. Yeah, I guess that show. This show has brought out the actos in me. So okay, now let me ask you this, Mr. Matt Miller. Do you, do you change up the material at all? I know you stay with that as a because that's a big fun routine to be naked. But uh, a, a lot of people use the naked show and its supportive audience as a way to sort of try new things out. Yeah, I've done, yeah I've, I've, the other jokes have always been different. It's just I like to close on that. Oh, okay, that's cool. I do have a, a, a same opener I do, but I'll keep that one secret. Can you say all right? Or I just say all right. That's something I used to do. I haven't done it in forever. Yeah. Because people are saying it, and I'm just like, <laughs> now I don't know if you don't funny, want to be or you're laughing at my thing, you know? Like I will say, I always love when you do that shit. Since I first seen you like do comedy, like what's up? Yeah, yeah, that's all right. It's just I don't know. I just it just it kind of it just it gets me every single time. And it's like you're just being an ass, like, but it's hilarious. It's like, and then you get the crowd. And then sometimes when they don't fuck with it, you, like actually work them in. And it's like it's oh, really man. it's smart and quickly what you do. Okay, man. so I gotta hold. Oh, thank you, man. All right, Every Andy, time you do it. I laugh. You so. take over my seat. Thank Andy's you. gonna take over. Oh, the uh, founder of the Naked Comedy Showcase. Take over my hosting duties. I was keeping this here, so it's not rattling the table. You can see where you are. Oh. If at the end you want to hit.